When I began to explore climate crisis, the first thing that came to mind was that, look, we're dealing with nature's laws here. The laws I teach are secondary. And we have to somehow structure the environmental law to match the magnitude and ticking time bomb that nature is imposing here. And so I came up with a different approach to climate crisis that is not based on our statutory laws because those have really failed. In fact, if those had worked, we wouldn't have this crisis in the first place. The approach I, I originated is based on the public trust doctrine. And that's a very old, ancient doctrine in the law. And in fact, it's evident in legal systems across the world. Um, it derives back from Roman law. It's, it's even uh, reflected in indigenous systems worldwide. And the concept is very simple. The concept behind the public trust is simply that the natural resources that we rely upon for our very survival and well-being are held in trust by our governments and need to be protected for present and also future generations of citizens. It, it couldn't really be more basic than that because um, citizens don't give their government the power to eradicate the resources they need for their very survival. And so the public trust doctrine basically is a legal principle that seeks to hold government accountable as trustees of our most crucial resources on this planet. 